So hi everyone, I had a couple of requests to do a video on things that you shouldn't be feeding your dog. A lot of you are going to be new dog owners very soon here and are wanting to know kind of what things in the kitchen should not be fed to dogs. So I'm going to give you a list of some of the things that you should never feed to your dogs. So the first thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about is anything that has seeds. So when you talk about fruits, you always want to make sure that the seeds are removed from the fruits that you're going to be giving your dogs. So anything like apple seeds, anything like a peach that has a pit, those pits and the seeds that are found in fruits should never be fed to dogs. So you just have to make sure that those are not in the fruits that you are giving to your animal. So the reason for this is because certain seeds when they're digested will release small amounts of cyanide. So that's of course not something we want in our dog at all. So just avoid feeding seeds to your dogs. The second thing that you're going to want to try to avoid feeding your dogs is anything containing chocolate. And this is a pretty common thing to know about. Chocolate is not good for dogs. Usually darker equals worse for your animals. So any type of dark chocolate is going to be a lot worse than um, milk chocolate, something like that. So I had a couple of calls when I used to work at vet clinics about people that had had their dogs eat a Reese's peanut butter cup. That's definitely not going to be as bad as if your dog eats a full block of dark chocolate. So um, chocolate in general isn't good, but the darker it is, the worse it is for your animal. All right, so the next thing that you wanna try and avoid feeding your dog is something that is called xylitol. And xylitol is basically an artificial sweetener. It's in a lot of different things. So it's in chewing gum, it can be in a whole bunch of candy, um, and it also can be in peanut butter. So you really wanna take a look at the ingredients um, of things that you're gonna be feeding your dog, especially peanut butter and just make sure that xylitol is not in it at all. So the reason for this is because it can increase insulin levels in your dog's blood and it also can lead to kidney failure in your animal. So it's, it's best to avoid if you possibly can. So the next thing that you want to avoid giving your animals is grapes or raisins. The reason that you want to avoid grapes and raisins is because it can cause kidney and liver damage in your animal if it's fed in excess. So basically just try and avoid grapes. There's a lot of other options for fruits that your dogs can have and it doesn't involve that kind of risk. So avoid grapes, avoid raisins, and it should be good. Now this one is of course pretty obvious again. Um, most people know that onions are not a good thing to feed your animal. Onions and chives are two things that should probably never be fed to dogs at all. Um, even if they're cooked, it can still be very bad for your animal. So the reason why you shouldn't feed onions or chives is because it actually has a negative effect on your dog's red blood cells. Do I hear a little whimper? Do I hear a little whimper? Are you right there? Why, hello. Okay, I close it. Oh, he decided to come in. Okay, good girl. Yes, a good girl. There we go. This is what you wanted. You go show mom and dad. You go show them. Go show them your frisbee. You go show them. Alright, so there's many other types of foods that you shouldn't be feeding your dogs. Some of these include macadamia nuts. Um, there's all sorts of foods that shouldn't be fed to your dogs, but there's also a lot of human foods that are um, completely safe for your animal if fed in moderation. So I hope that this has helped you guys a little bit. 
If you want to, you can always leave a comment down below and list off some other foods that aren't okay to feed to animals. I'm sure that everyone appreciates um, comments and feedback from other people as well. And I hope you guys have a really great day. We'll see you later. Bye. Thank you.